it's Chris Voss from Real Estate Lifestyle. Um, I just wanted to go over, uh, you know, some things we do in that business to try to uh, reach our goals and dreams. Um, this is a, a free way you guys can, you know, get things done, uh, get a deal done, uh, reach out to homeowners and, you know, try to make it happen, guys. So, you know, this is just a conversation I'm having with her uh, to try to get, uh, you know, uh, a property, her property under contract. So I just wanted to show you guys, you know, what kind of questions you can ask. So, you know, of course, you want to ask if, uh, you know, she's a homeowner or he's a homeowner. Right. So, you know, of course, you're going to say, yeah. So one of the important questions that we want to ask um, is, uh, you know, when the last time anything was updated by year so that the cash buyer will, you know, know when everything was updated because the cash buyer will have to, you know, update everything if it wasn't. So it's just questions asking about, you know, the updates, uh, the plumbing, the roof, electric, AC, uh, and seeing if it's uh, septic or sewer because that's a major cost there. Um, she's saying like, you know, 17 years ago. So. Uh, that's something that you need to know so that you can let your um, cash buyer know, you know, that um, it's been a long time. So you're going to have to update everything. Um, so, you know, you want to move on with the other major things like the bathroom and the kitchen, which is huge. You know what I mean? Because, you know, that's uh, something that has to be done over and it's, you know, pretty costly. So you want to ask that question. Um, so after you ask that question, right, you want to ask them, you know, you know, why are they selling? You know what? You know, try to get that motivation out of them. You know, and uh, as you can see, she's saying she's unable to finish, so that's why you know she's trying to sell it. So you know, she tr she needs to get rid of it because she ran out of money. All right, so um, you know, I'm just letting her know. You know, since you know it's uh gonna be a little bit to bring it back. You know, what she's except seventy. You know, uh, because you know all the work that needs to be done. Um, she's saying she can't do it. So I was just asking her, right, when a homeowner says that, we don't want to just say, okay, well, have a nice day, right? We want to see if we can still make the deal work by asking how close can you come to my offer, you know? Uh, can you meet me halfway? Uh, you know, because, you know, you have to do some work to be able to make some money out of it. And, you know, her and you working together, you'll be able to sell the house, you know, to a new homeowner, you know, which is, you know, we, they, they, that's their dream, right? New homeowners are dreams to move in. So, you know, she's just telling me I need to come look at it because, you know, um, you know, I, I was asking her, you know, those questions. So I'm just telling her, know, letting her know I'm in Jacksonville. So she might have to send me pictures so that I can see it. You know, my team there in Georgia, you know, they will back me up and, you know, go over and do the inspection and things like that. You know, once I get it under contract. So she's telling me that, you know, um, the pictures won't do no justice because it's a gym. You know, so, you know, the homeowner have pride in her house. So I'm just letting her know, you know, that's cool. But. Um, you know, with the pictures, I still could be able to, you know, work the deals out, you know, run my numbers, you know, to see if everybody can be happy. Um, I'm just letting them know, you know, you know, teamwork makes the dream work, right, guys? So, you know, we work together, get this deal where everybody can be happy. Then, you know, we both walk away, you know, happy. So she's telling me that, you know, 70 won't work for her because, you know, she paid 75 for it. So I'm letting her know, you know, hey, I can do, you know, 80 then, you know, um, and then that be everybody be happy. Right. You know, it's a win win for everybody. So, you know, at the end of the day, she was saying she want to, you know, get back with me tomorrow to let me know if my offer stands. So I'm just letting you guys, you know, see, you know, by just taking action, you know, you can get a deal done. You know, and this is all through text. I haven't called her and talked to her or anything. So I'm just trying to show you guys if you keep pushing, you can reach your goals and dreams. OK, guys. All right, have a great day. Let's go champ.